and we're back. Um, so we're in the shop, as you've seen in the last video, or maybe you didn't see the last video, but just loaded up the truck. We're about to head down to AC, get the booth set up, and yeah, we're gonna hop in the truck, head out there, and I'm sure we'll pick up the camera along the way. And if not, then we'll see you when we get in Atlantic City. Howdy. We are, we're a little past halfway to Atlantic City. 60 miles out. No stops. Yeah, we haven't stopped yet. I'm a little hungry though, so I would like to stop soon. But we ain't stopping unless we find us a Chick-fil-A. Maybe something else. I don't know. I am hungry though. But, um, copper. Oh, yeah. Oh my gosh. Sketchy. Good thing we obey those speed limits and wear seat belts and all that good stuff. Wear seat belts and all that good stuff. But yeah, we're going straight to the field where the show is. We're gonna set up and try to find our way back to the hotel after that. Cause I'm gonna leave my truck at the show. Cause if you've ever been to AC, you know that uh, all the parking lots are pretty small and like indoor lots. And yeah, this thing ain't gonna fit very well in those things. We're back. Um, we stopped for Chick-fil-A. Our bellies are full. We just pulled into the show. Um, see all the hotels and stuff. That's like the AC strip. I'm a little bit lost. I don't really know where to go. So we're just kind of cruising. And uh, we're gonna find our spot eventually. We'll get there sooner or later. This guy building a sandcastle. Little mermaid. Oh wow! Yeah, it's coming it down. It's actually raining right now. It is raining, and there's a single cloud in the sky. That's the single cloud that we're getting rained on by. All right, so we are at the gate of the show. We just set the booth up, we didn't film anything. Um, someone just peeled off in a 328i. Pretty crazy. Um, yeah, we left the trucks there, so we're about to hop in an Uber to the hotel. And uh, yeah, get ready for a fun night. And then we'll be back here bright and early, watch the trucks up, and get ready for the show. We'll see you soon. So we're at the real Caesar's Palace. Caesar actually lived here, apparently. And it's nice and cold, it smells like a hotel. Haha, <laughs> it worked. We got a cool view. Yeah, actually we do have a pretty cool view. Yeah, it's alright. Oh, look at that. Pretty cool, pretty cool. We had a lot of beverages last night. And it's a little later than it really should be for us, but... Yeah, we are heading to the show. Not sure how we're gonna get there yet, but uh, we're gonna be there soon. I fucking should. Are you gonna get it? I should. I don't know, I think it'll suit you. Hydrate. I feel like Aquafinas have the most twistable bottle caps, or like the most twist. Like there's so many threads on this thing. We made it. We're here. It's hot, and I'm American. Pitching tents. <laughs> All right, we are here at Atlantic City Truck Meet Show. Truck Meet or Show? Oh my God, you don't even know the Daytona goddamn name of it. Daytona, Atlantic City, I said. <laughs> a little update on the boot trucks. This one took a Home Depot hit to the headlight on the way down. I think it'll buff right out. You got the crew. Definitely buff right out. Buffing out the, all the uh, bug guts and carcasses. All the rock chips. Oh yeah. Kevin just painting his friggin' tires and tire shine. <laughs> they call me they call me Danny. <laughs> yeah. Um, we got Nick's truck over here. He's got a nice fifth gen, all white. Um, we did the headlights on it, we did um, some of the paint matching. Um, we did the mirrors, we did the taillights. Um, sitting on some nice KG ones. So we got Nick. We'll put the IGs down here. Mr. Kevin Doherty. Mr. Danny Durasmo. And Mr. Keith Holland. How we doing? Oh, good. Keith better than, better is the. Than this morning. Yeah, better than this morning. It was a rough morning. 
Uh, Keith is the only one I know that polishes wheels on a weekly basis and um, da daily basis. You what? <laughs> Drunk or polishing wheels. Um, Christina and I are gonna. What up? We're gonna walk around and see what kind of cool trucks. We're gonna check out that Ford right there. I think that's. Oh yeah, that's Mr. Evan Butler. We're gonna say what up to him. So we got Evan's truck over here. He's got a nice big. What lift is it? Eight inch or ten inch? PMS. All right, so we just walked the strip. This is the back of the American Force booth. But what I wanted to show you is how far these trucks go. So the show is only on one little airstrip, and then we got the other, I think this is VIP parking over here, and it just goes down all the way. Now we're gonna walk, we're gonna walk towards the semis. So apparently there's a semi-presence here. And then I think spectator parking is all the way down there. So there's tons of trucks over there. There's tons of trucks over here. I'm too short, you can't really see. So we're gonna keep walking, maybe show some nice trucks that we like, Christina likes. You know, something I can really appreciate is a nice 1500 build. Kind of all paint match. We're just gonna cruise around the show because we walked a bit around a bit and it's really really hot. So. Yeah. I feel like the camera guy right now. Don't you owe me? Yeah, you owe me, don't it? That gets covered in diesel. All right. Coming at you from Atlantic City Truck Meet, we got. Uh, oh, there it is! Wait, hold up, check it out. Sorry, interruption here. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, damn it, Danny. Now we gotta start all over again. Damn, that thing came out sick, right? Yeah, it came out really good. I love that thing. Part of the vlog. We're back at the hotel. I have the gimbal, but it doesn't have a camera. Broke the yeah, almost, almost broke I it. almost smushed it in the revolving door. That would have been bad. But yeah, we're going to shower up, get some dinner, head out for the night. Good eats. Give us a rating. This is our first food review. Yeah, yeah, this is a first How food is review. this place? What's this place? Taz, Taza? Tatsa. Tatsa. What are you eating? A shoyatel. I don't even know how to explain it. It's in a, it's in a pastry. All right, one to ten. One bite, everyone knows the rules. Well, there's a little more than one bite, but I rated at a 6.5. That's bad. Howdy. It's Sunday. It's 9. We had another late night. But we're going to go ahead to the show now. We'll see you there. Yo, what? I've never seen and somebody are, like, yeah, polish their high. wheels yeah. more. I don't know how much dirtier they got since they were sitting here. There's just gonna be no metal left by the time he's. <laughs> yeah, he's he's just gonna polish. Down yeah, he's gonna polish gonna it down there. to nothing. He's gonna take the American Force right off the lift. <laughs> <laughs> Put a little more elbow grease into it. We're on our way home. Uh, the show just wrapped up. We didn't film any of the breakdown of the tents and all that stuff like that because Eddie was um, out doing some filming of some of the other trucks and stuff like that with the gimbal. So we got a second food review coming at you right now. Pretty sure Steph did one in, earlier in this video. I think he did the uh, Svilla Dell in the lobby of the hotel. Um, but we just stopped for diesel and uh, Chedward thought it would be a great idea to buy Combo's spicy honey mustard flavor. Weird combo. But <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna taste them, we're gonna give you a review. You're gonna taste it too, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, One bite, everyone knows the rules. I'm 
strongly on these. I like them. Honey mustard goes good with pretzels. Not too spicy. Pretty good treat. Not the best I've ever had, but for a snack food, not bad. I'm gonna give them a 6.4 out of 10. Give them a solid eight. It's a rookie score. Solid eight. You can't do solid numbers. Solid eight. You gotta do a decimal. Solid 8.0. I apologize for his rookie food review. Solid 8.0. We're gonna we're gonna work on this. We're gonna, 8 zip. We're gonna tighten it 8. up. 8.0. We're gonna tighten We're gonna tighten this up. Cause we're gonna be doing a lot right, of uh, that's food review too. A lot of food 8. reviews. 0. But um yeah, it was a super fun show. We had a really good time. Um we enjoyed meeting all you guys and uh yeah, it was a cool turnout. It was the first show, first Atlantic City truck meet. Um, so hopefully they do another one next year and uh, have have an even bigger turnout because this was pretty impressive for a first show. So uh, yeah, we had a good time. Hopefully they like add Friday next year because uh, it was kind of weird. Like Saturday, it was only really Saturday and like Sunday it was kind of like calm there. It was like because everyone's kind of getting ready to leave. So hopefully they add like a Friday, which would be a lot cooler. So if you're listening. Friday next year be cool maybe even Thursday but um yeah so I hope you guys enjoyed the video um we're gonna head back to the shop we got plenty of other stuff in the building that we gotta get moving on and then uh, who knows what the next show is could be SEMA could be maybe Myrtle Beach Chuck me I don't know maybe something else who knows I think SEMA's before that SEMA's before that yeah okay so then the next show will be out of SEMA but until then we got a lot of work to do and um yeah so um if you like what you saw in the video as in the trucks and you're looking to get something like that done for your truck give us a call shoot us a dm email anything like that just reach out to us and uh yeah we'll get you uh we'll get you set up and ready for the next show so you could be out there with us showing off your cool ride um also Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, share, um, turn on notifications, and follow us on all our social medias like Instagram, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube, all that stuff. And yeah, so we will see you guys in the next video. Later.